I feel great. Um, I definitely felt that I needed that. Um, it's nothing like making plays. Um, and it was a it was a pivotal moment in the game. I believe that play definitely helped us helped us win that ball game, kick that field goal, go up six, and make it harder uh, for the Giants to try to march it down the field. Um, but it was a great team success today. Uh, Chandler had a heck of a game. Uh, early on, offense had it rolling, and as a defense, we did it. We did what we needed to do to keep those guys from scoring more than what we had. So we continue to build off this team, this team win, and um, who knows what can happen. What was this whole day like for you? This whole day? Yeah. Man, the day was, um, I just told the guys, obviously, you know, being out for six weeks and it's about to get to that point of the season, you know, guys starting to get tired, legs getting a little a little heavy. But I told these guys, you know, um, if you don't, if you forgot what it looked like or you don't know what it looked like, just follow me, you know, because obviously I know I have some fresh legs, but I wanted to, 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 to energize my players off my play and the way I was moving around on the field. And I believe I did that. And um, if we continue to do that through uh, throughout these nine weeks, we could, I, I believe the, the skies can be the limit for us. When's the last time you had a blitz? The last time I had a blitz was against uh, Green Bay last year, and I got I tackled a running back in the backfield. Good memory, huh? Times did they throw you away today? Uh, today, when I was in, well, man, none. Uh, <laughs> in zone, they got, uh, I would want to say three times. Perception, is that Yes, right? uh, sounds about right. That's, no score. That's typical. Sure. That's typical. Emotional today, or was the feeling the same? Emotional? Nah, not at all. Feeling was definitely the same. It just, I just, I don't know. I just felt extra geek. I don't know if it was the fresh legs that I had, or just so ready to get out there on the field with my guys. Um, not emotional, but definitely very, very excited to finally put that uh, that game uniform back on. It's been a while since I played a full game. You know, I think my last full game was against who we played last last year. Seattle, that was my last full game, so it's been a while. <laughs> exactly. No one ever questions your passion, but do you get a new sense of love for this game now that you're kind of back on the field once again? Um, I get a, I got a great love of the uh, – well, I always had love for the game. I always had passion, but I'm extremely excited that we can play man-to-man -man this year. <laughs> Just since since the team this year, having sat out, look, looking, looking in, uh -huh. you know, what's your sense of this team compared to other teams have been on? Um, young, for one, very young. Um, you know, these guys are, you know, the first four weeks was a, a little tough for us, you know, trying to figure out what we can and what we can't do. Um, the communication was a little off, but now I think since guys have settled in on the defensive side, that's what I can speak for. On the defensive side, I think we're now starting to settle in, coordinating to understand what he can call and can't call. Um, learning, now really having a good grasp of his uh, his personnel, putting the right guys in position to be successful. Um, you know, I think now we're 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 definitely starting to turn that corner. You know, we just could getting road wins is huge for a young team, and the way that the the way that we're getting them in the fourth quarter, I think that can definitely um, help grow our confidence throughout the throughout the rest of the season. How much did Vance communicate to you during the week or anything that you were going to have a cornerback blitz in this game? Or did he just kind of call it and you went? Oh, yeah, it was always in the game. It was always in the game plan. And um, uh, I won't say this game plan was tailored for me, but they definitely won. They, they, Vance did a great job, and defensive coaching staff put, did a great job uh, of putting me in position um, to help this team and, and help make plays like that down the stretch. You know, fourth quarter, you have to make big plays, and big-time players make big-time plays in those type of moments. So Vance caught, dialed up the perfect blitz, and um, and it paid off. Was that you fanning down Chase Edmonds? Yeah, you? he was on fire, man. He had a, he had a, he had a turkey today. He had a three-piece. Um, Chase had a great, great, great game. He picked up the slack, obviously not having David here today. Um, <clears throat> he did a great job of stepping in, and, and, and he was ready. He he, he 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 played unbelievable, and, and on the road, if you want to be a successful team, you have to pack your running game, special team, the defense, and I believe we did that today, and that's why we came out on top. How much you enjoy the back and forth with Giants fans? Oh I, man, I'm telling, you, I was telling, I forget who I was telling that to today. I love Giants and Philly fans. I mean, just the 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 passion, the atmosphere. Just those fans, they love the game of football, and they will do anything for their team to help get a, a, a key player on the opposing team out of their game. But I'm old enough, I understand that, and it's all funny games to me. Saying that you, um, your return helped him, but just by having him back there, he felt more comfortable. Mm -hmm. What is 
him knowing that you have a pass an edge rusher like him, mm -hmm. what does that do for you? Um, I think it, it, it works in both ways. You know, having two pa great pass rushers like Sizzle and Chandler and, and, and having Murphy grow up the way he did on the outside. You know, this defense predicates off the pass rushers and the guys on the, ed on the edges, which are Chandler and Sizzle, Sizzle and me and Murphy. So if we're able to do our job week in and week out, playing very competitive um, every single down, the sky's going to be the limit. But today, I think the P2 effect set in because – it's the first time we got a pick in six weeks, and as soon as I get back, we get over interception. So the P2 effect is definitely the real deal. <laughs> Thank you.